हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आई एम धर्मेंद्र पाठक इन माय प्रीवियस वीडियो आई वेड डिस्क्राइब अबाउट लेबोरेटरी प्रिपरेशन ऑफ कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड गैस जनरल प्रिपरेशन ऑफ कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड गैस इट्स प्रॉपर्टीज एंड यूजेज टुडे इन दिस वीडियो वी डिस्कस अबाउट हाउ अमोनिया गैस can be prepared how it is prepared in a laboratory and in industry what are its properties and uses in our daily life it is important chapter from chemistry of class 10 so to know about which type of question will ask in examination what are import tenth terms related to ammonia gas watch this video up to end and if you got any question then comment it i will try to solve these all questions which you want to know at first we discuss about what is ammonia ammonia is chemical compound that contains or it is made up of one nitrogen and three hydrogen atoms and its molecular formula is nh3 molecule of ammonia represented by nh3 its molecular mass is 14, nitrogen 14, 3 hydrogen 1, and therefore 14 plus 3 into 1 equal to 17 amu. Also, we can write our unit. In ammonia gas, nitrogen atom is bonded with 3 hydrogen atom, and Now here we draw nitrogen contains five valence electrons. Three electrons are shared with three hydrogen electron, or nitrogen share one electron with each hydrogen atom to form covalent bond. Listen. Your octet of nitrogen get fulfilled. Duplet of hydrogen completed. Duplet of hydrogen complete here. Duplet of hydrogen. And here we found that which is equal to nitrogen that contains three hydrogen. It is called simple molecular structure of nitrogen. and here exact shape here not describe only bonding structure of nitrogen or ammonia is like that after that here nitrogen and hydrogen atoms are present in ammonia molecule and therefore it is prepared in a large scale from nitrogen and hydrogen when a nitrogen and hydrogen atoms are combined at a high temperature high pressure in presence of iron and molybdenum catalyst then it gives ammonia gas which is known as industrial preparation of ammonia and the name of a process is haber's process and here we write preparation of ammonia at first we describe about general or general preparation of ammonia when any ammonium salt is heated with alkali then it gives ammonia gas or when ammonium salt heated with 
alkali gives ammonia gas or ammonia gas is formed suppose we consider any chemical ammonium salt like a ammonium chloride ammonium sulfate when it is heated with alkali like sodium hydroxide calcium hydroxide when it is heated then it gives salt water and along with ammonia gas is evolved here the equation is balanced any kind of ammonium salt when heated with metal hydroxide then it gives ammonia gas second method of preparation is in a large scale when we need ammonia then here it is called in a large scale or in industry ammonia gas can be prepared by Haber's process what is Haber's process here Haber's process and that process describe about when nitrogen and hydrogen gas here nitrogen gas obtained for this process by liquefying air and hydrogen gas obtained for this process by electrolysis of water and here we write when nitrogen and hydrogen gas combined at high temperature and high pressure gives in presence of for such chemical reaction what is needed here catalyst and promoter needed in presence of iron and molybdenum catalyst listen here iron is positive catalyst molybdenum is also positive catalyst and here molybdenum acts like a promoter which increase rate of chemical reaction then what it gives ammonia gas ammonia gas is obtained by this process and in chemical reaction we write nitrogen gas when combined with three molecule of hydrogen gas and that chemical reaction is a reversible reaction at high temperature high pressure in presence of iron and molybdenum catalyst it gives ammonia when pressure reduced degrees then the reaction shift backward that is nit ammonia reverse into nitrogen and hydrogen this process is called industrial preparation of ammonia gas after that year in a laboratory we can prepare ammonia gas from heating ammonium chloride salt and alkali and here we write laboratory preparation of ammonia in a lab we can use or we can prepare ammonia gas from ammonium salt and here when ammonium salt like ammonium chloride heated with alkali like sodium hydroxide or calcium hydroxide gives ammonia gas 
here. And how this chemical reaction takes place? At first, we take ammonium chloride and calcium hydroxide, both are found in solid form. In the ratio, here at first we write on heating it gives 2 is to 1 calcium chloride, water and ammonia. And to balance it here we write 2, 2 molecule hydrogen becomes 4 to 8 to 10 and here 3 to the 6, 4, 10. And in this way the gas obtained is ammonia. Which chemicals required for laboratory preparation of ammonia gas? Here the name of chemicals are ammonium chloride 2 part and calcium hydroxide 1 part. These two chemicals are needed for laboratory preparation of ammonia gas. After that here, which apparatus are needed? The ammonia gas is prepared in a laboratory. This diagram explain about process of laboratory preparation of ammonia. Here we take hard glass test tube. In that hard glass test tube, we mix ammonium chloride and calcium hydroxide in the ratio 2 is to 1 or 2 part ammonium chloride, 1 part calcium hydroxide. And then we fit it in a standard like a hard glass test tube is slightly inclined downward. And why it is so? Because here heating process applied. In this process calcium chloride water is formed there. And cracking of hard glass test tube takes place. And to prevent from cracking what hard glass test tube is slightly inclined downward. Such that when water molecule form it get collected at near the cork. And then we connect delivery tube to the connector. That connector contains line tower. Listen. Here a line tower contains quick line filled in it. That quick line acts like a when it is heated then along with ammonia gas some moisture of also here evaporates to absorb that moisture quick lime or calcium oxide is used in lime tower here it is called calcium oxide used in lime tower and here to collect gas inverted gas jar is used there why? Because naturally our ammonia gas is lighter than air. After that here, to hold this, listen here, what we use? A stand that is fitted with lime tower and gas jar both. After that, we write the name of apparatus. Here the name Test tube used is not ordinary test tube. Why? Because we have to apply heat there and for heating purpose a special type of hard glass test tube is used and here it is called hard glass test tube. Hard glass test tube is used for that. Here it is stained stand. Now the chemical used in it is ammonium chloride and calcium hydroxide in the ratio 2 is to 1. Here it is burner. Now delivery tube. Line tower. 
and here the gas co obtained is ammonia and it is gas jar and in this way what we found that in a laboratory preparation of ammonia gas the chemical used is ammonium chloride and calcium hydroxide and which apparatus are needed hard glass burner stand delivery tube gas jar and a lime tower used here why your lime tower is connected to absorb moisture present in ammonia gas or water vapor which come along with your given that here through the delivery tube after that other point we should notice that the hard glass test tube should be inclined downward slightly inclined downward why because in chemical reaction when ammonium chloride and calcium hydroxide is heated then it produce calcium chloride and water which absorb heat and cracking of hard glass test tube may take place to prevent from cracking when it is slightly inclined downward then water from there get moves downward and prevent from cracking other point we should notice that ammonia gas is collected in inverted gas jar why because it is lighter than air therefore it displays atmospheric gases downward after that year the formed gas is ammonia how we recognize how we test it so then we discuss about test of ammonia gas and here the best test is your ammonia gas is basic or alkaline in nature therefore we can test it first is your ammonia gas or having a different smell pungent or ammonical smell it has pungent ammonical smell or a smell like a hard rotten egg like a smell different smell and that smell is called pungent ammonical smell other second test we can confirm that when we keep moist red litmus paper in gas jar containing ammonia gas then it change into blue color it means what it is or it has alkaline property and here we write it turn moist red litmus paper to blue or when it is passed through the alkali solution then it change into pink when gas pass through the lime water or simply here also we write phenol ethylene solution containing water then turn pink color that pink coloration is also test of alkali and these test help to confirm that the prepared gas is ammonia after that here we discuss about different physical property of ammonia and here common physical properties are ammonia gas having is colorless and here we write it is colorless gas 
having its order is pungent smell pungent or simply ammonical smell it gives ammonical smell but having no any color and second test of that second physical property is here it is lighter than air and due to that reason it is collected by downward displacement of air it displaces air downward and ammonia gas goes to upward third is here it is highly soluble in water it get dissolved in water and form alkali that we discuss in chemical property but high amount of high volume of ammonia get dissolved in water other we can write here it is alkaline in nature because it turn moist red litmus paper to red litmus paper to blue color they are for called alkaline in nature and also solidify it change into it solidify at change into solid form at minus 78 degree celsius the these properties of ammonia is called physical property what are it is colorless gas having pungent smell lighter than air highly soluble in water alkaline in nature and other is its solidification is at minus 78 degree celsius after that we discuss about some chemical properties of ammonia and here we discuss detail about that here how ammonia reacts with different chemicals the some important chemical properties here we described chemical properties of ammonia at first year that ammonia gas is soluble in water or it turn moist red litmus paper to blue why because alkaline in nature and here moisture is needed why because when ammonia get dissolved in water then it form alkali and first property is here when nh3 or ammonia gas dissolved in water gives alkali name is here ammonium hydroxide and here we write ammonia plus h2 that form NH4H that alkali causes here it formation of alkali causes it turn red litmus paper to blue color other important chemical property is when ammonia gas heated with carbon dioxide at high temperature then it change into urea and when ammonia gas heated with carbon dioxide and what it form here it gives urea and the chemical reaction is as a carbon dioxide plus ammonia the molecular formula of urea is co nh2 whole to two amide group it remains present and it is organic compound but made from inorganic chemicals and also known as first organic compound that is prepared in laboratory and along with that water molecule is formed to balance nitrogen here we write to this is called urea listen after that here third number is here given here it is alkaline gas therefore when it is react with acids then it gives salt acid solution then salt and water and here we write when 
ammonia gas reacts with hydrochloric acid gives white forms of ammonium chloride or simply question may ask like a, what happen when the glass rod depth in hydrochloric acid kept in ammonia gas jar ammonia containing gas jar then white forms are formed that forms is the form of ammonium chloride here glass rod containing HCl and the gas jar containing ammonia which react gives salt ammonium chloride and this reaction is called reaction between ammonia gas and acid and here we discuss one more reaction like other acid in the form of solution when ammonia solution here in the form of gas like when ammonia solution how solution is made when ammonia gas is dissolved in water ammonium hydroxide is formed and when ammonia solution reacts with acid that forms salt and water both here and here we write gives salt and water and we can write the chemical reaction like a NH4OH is ammonia solution suppose acid is sulfuric acid then what it gives the salt is ammonium sulfate and along with that water is formed and to balance here we write ammonium hydroxide 4 to the 8 to 10 to 12 4 to the 8 4 12 oxygen is here 2 4 6 4 2 6 and that is called salt and in this way ammonia reacts with various chemicals and after that we discuss about what are the importance of ammonia gas for which purpose it is used and here we write common is some common use of or uses of ammonia gas and which is as at first year uses of ammonia and already we discussed in chemical properties of ammonia that when ammonia gas heated with carbon dioxide it gives urea and therefore it is used in preparation of chemical fertilizers fertilizer like urea ammonium nitrate or any kind of ammonium third is here it react with acid and gives ammonium salt therefore other uses here it is used in preparation of ammonium salt ammonium salt like ammonium chloride ammonium sulfate ammonium nitrate any kind of salt can be prepared it depends upon which acid is used there third is here it is used in manufacturing of of nitric acid or when ammonia body in air then it gives nitrous oxide nitric oxide again bond converted into nitrogen dioxide then dissolve in water it gives nitric acid are also called by Ostwald process after that year liquid ammonia used in blueprint of map 
while in blue print liquid ammonia is used because that printed map lasts for thousand of years or a long time other we can write ammonia is used as coolant in refrigerator or ammonia gas is used in refrigerator as cooling agent it absorb heat energy and therefore having cooling effect other we can write it is used in water fountain or when ammonia gas pass through the water containing phenolphthalein then it change into or color of water change into pink color and in this way fountain is formed and ammonia water is used there and several more use of ammonia is found and in a lab also here several it is used as a important laboratory reagent and such type of terms are related to ammonia gas for class 10 and question may ask related to diagrammatic which chemicals are needed what are laboratory process of preparation what is industrial preparation physical property chemical property and uses in the next video we more discuss about which type of long questions will ask in se examination from some gases with answer